Welcome back, Math Grizz. Today, we will multiply three factors. Multiply two times six times two. We will start by associating two of the factors with parentheses. We will associate or group two times six together. Now we will always solve parentheses first. The two and the six are inside of the parentheses. So let's multiply two times six first. Two times six equals 12. Let's bring down the times two. The last step is to multiply by the third factor, which was the two. So let's multiply 12 times two. 12 times two equals 24. So we know that two times six times two equals 24. Three times four times three. Let's associate the four and the three together. Remember, always solve parentheses first. So we have to solve four times three first. Four times three equals 12. Let's bring down the three times. Let's multiply by the third factor, which was the three. Let's multiply three times 12. Three times 12 equals 36. So three times four times three equals 36. Let's multiply two times five times two. Let's associate the two and the five by grouping them with parentheses. Always solve parentheses first. Two times five equals 10. Let's bring down the times two. Let's multiply by the third factor, which was the two. So 10 times two equals 20. Two times five times two equals 20. Multiply two times two times three. Let's go ahead and associate the two and the three. We will solve parentheses first. Two times three equals six. Let's bring down the two times. Let's multiply by our third factor, which was the two that we left at first. Two times six equals 12. So two times two times three equals 12. Three times two times four. Let's associate two of the factors. Let's do the two times four first. Remember, you always solve parentheses first. Two times four equals eight. Let's bring down the three times. Let's multiply by the third factor. So we have to multiply three times eight, which equals 24. Three times two times four equals 24. Four times three times six. Let's associate two of our factors with parentheses. Four times three. Let's solve parentheses first. Four times three equals 12. Let's bring down the times six. So now we'll multiply by the third factor, which was the six. 12 times six equals 72. So four times three times six equals 72. <laughs>